so, here we are again. Hello. <sighs> it's alcohol time. I say alcohol, it may not still be alcohol. It's, it's a drink of doom. It's a very old drink. It's me saying, hmm, I didn't really do excess over Christmas, so I'm sure I can get away with a sneaky little glass of the finest aged rosé now. I say finest aged, I mean god-awful cheap stuff that's been left to rot for some years. There's, there's no clue as to how many years, but this came in the box with the pony sherry and other things. I'm going to say 20, 30 years, maybe more. It's, uh, let's delay the toxic wine death by trying to read the, was it Portuguese? Portuguese, product de Portugal, yes, produce of Portugal. The Portuguese, it is from the caves of Tedioso. <laughs> it is tedious wine, or it is Tildetho wine, I don't know. It is Limitada. Mm, I'm sure it's going to taste very Limitada. Rio Mayo? Rigor mortis, is that Portuguese for rigor mortis? Is this what happens within a couple of hours of drinking this? Vinho Rosé, 150 millilitres, medium amado. <sighs> Casalerio, Dave said, it must be, oh no, it must be served chilled and this is at room temperature. This could be where it's all going to go wrong then. Oh, right. I can't put it off any longer, can I? Let's try to get in. Oh, oh, I don't know if I want to do this. I don't know if I can do this. How how do you do this? I can't get into it. Oh, doctor, I think I've got a drink problem. I can't open a bottle. Oh, it's peeling. Not appealing, just peeling. It's... is that a foil? Okay. Okay, we might be facing a problem. At least it's well sealed, hey! This won't have gone off. <laughs> Look how <laughs> hermetically sealed for freshness this is. Foil sealed for freshness, just like crisps. <laughs> it's got a plastic. Oh, I, I thought it would be a cork. It's a plastic. Um, we'll go any further. It's a bit murky, isn't it? Mm. But I have my finest crystal glass for my finest Portuguese rosé. <laughs> So hopefully we will be able to deduce any level of murk. <sighs> oh my god. I'm not sure how we're supposed to open this. Not like this would be my guess. I also don't want to spill it because I have a horrible feeling it may try to grow and take over the world. There's, there's not much sludge on the not cork. And it smells. Well, it smells. Let's be honest, it smells. No. It smells a bit like cheap sherry. God. I've had slight food poisoning, which is the reason why I've delayed doing this. But, um... <laughs> I kind of thought, what the hell? I'm already feeling unwell. <laughs> I might as well go for the double whammy. That is not filling me with confidence. Is it filling you with confidence? <laughs> Yeah, I'm not going to be drinking all of this, I assure you. Reassuringly, there are no pieces, there's, there's no bits, there's no, no floaters in there. So this, this could be ridiculously well kept for what it is. How does it smell now? It doesn't smell of much, but it does have that slight sherry smell. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Mm. Okay. Oh, I'll put it back. But mm. yes, floating a bit because I couldn't swallow. Sorry. Um mm. <laughs> I just did my finger into um and it burned the end of my finger. That's not good. Okay, it tastes like cheap sherry. Old, weak cheap sherry. But it definitely says Vino Rosé. So what is this? 
I thought this was cheap rosé wine. I'm sure this is cheap rosé wine. Why does it taste of sherry? Is that how they make sherry? Do they just take cheap Portuguese rosé, move it to Spain, leave it for 30 years? And, oh, look, it's sherry. Um, yeah. Well, um, it's better than the pony. I do need my little medicinal rum. Mmm. I'm really hoping, or at least pretending to myself, that this is the 54% stuff, that that will kill all the badness that I have just put in my mouth. Hmm, is the best response I have to that. I wouldn't drink it for pleasure. I wouldn't drink it for any sort of preference at all. But it might be surprisingly not lethal, which, a bit like previous drinks, scares me. If that can sit in a plasticky, corked, not bottle of something, not chilled, for a lifetime, and only taste of sherry rather than death, then you have to question, what did they make it with? 